Hey everybody, this is Doug with another short video. This one is about cardiac resynchronization therapy. What is it and how does it work? Now remember, I'm not a medical professional giving you medical advice. I'm just some guy on the internet. I hope this information is helpful for you so that you understand cardiac resynchronization therapy a little better and that you can have a more meaningful conversation with your physician. Thanks. Cardiac resynchronization therapy, CRT. It's a fancy phrase, it's a fancy set of words. What it basically means is that we're going to try and resynchronize the bottom chambers of your heart. If you're getting a CRT device, it, it means you're getting a three lead system. And the reason why is that the bottom chambers of your heart are not beating together. When that happens, the heart is not pumping blood effectively and it will try to do things to compensate. And one of the biggest problems is that the left side of the heart, the left ventricle starts to enlarge and that's not good. That's a progression of heart failure. So this, the cardiac resynchronization therapy uses lead wires, kind of like this, to stimulate both sides of the heart, both ventricles, and gets them to contract together. That Im improves your heart's function, and improves your blood flow, and in some cases, it can reverse the effects of heart failure. Some people may see a rise in their ejection fraction. This is the amount of blood that your heart pumps per beat. Other people might even see a reduction in the size of their heart. Uh, so it's, it actually can reverse the effects of heart failure, which is pretty cool. One important thing to note is that in order to get the heart chambers, the bottom chambers to beat together, most, almost all of CRT patients are paced 100% of the time. That's just to ensure that the bottom chambers beat together in perfect synchrony. Now it doesn't mean you're pacemaker dependent, but it does mean that your heart is going to be paced 100% of the time, just so that those chambers are beating together. Now there's two different kinds of CRT devices. There's a CRT-P, CRT pacemaker, and there's a CRT-D, defibrillator. Uh, you would get the different devices based on what your heart is doing. The main purpose again is to get those bottom chambers beating together, but the secondary problem is if your heart is beating too fast for some reason, you're getting fatal rhythms that uh, could cause you to die, you'll get a defibrillator and that will prevent the fatal rhythms from, from uh, continuing. If not, you'll just get the pacemaker version and, and that's there just to pace your, your heart. Uh, and both do the same main function, which is getting the bottom chambers to beat together. The defibrillator has the extra added function of preventing a fatal heart rhythm from, from taking off and taking your life. That's really it. That's the basics of cardiac resynchronization therapy. It's there to get the bottom chambers of your heart beating together so that your blood is pumping more effectively and you can start feeling better. I hope the video was helpful. I hope you learned a little bit and uh, that you'll subscribe to my page and maybe check out some of my other videos. Otherwise, I hope you have a great day. Thanks for watching.